Hello my friend, welcome to my channel. Today I've got Essence, a whisper of spring. I'm going to do some smush stamping. This is unfrogettable glass frog. It is an unscented peel off base coat or latex barrier. You can use it for both. And here is Essence the gel polish, a whisper of spring. Beautiful shade. So I'm going in with my first coat and it's going on rather well. Now this one's not as fantastic as some of the other essence polishes I've tried that could have been one coaters, but it is a very nice polish. Hi Woody, how you doing? And here we go with our second coat. This one is gorgeous. I don't know, I guess it might be considered lilac. It's got a pink look to it. I mean, it's definitely purple, but it's got pink to it too. And Woody's back again. I'm going to top it with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat so we can do our smush stamping. Seal this in, get it to dry all the way down before we go on to the next step. Such a delicate polish. I just love it. There we go. I'm going to be using BMS115 my clear jelly stamper scraper and my monocle stamper. I'll be using Nicole Diary NS11 and Nicole Diaries NS08. Y'all have seen me do these before. I'm just putting dots down on the on the stamping plate of the polishes. Just kind of spread them out a little bit, you know. Get them on there. And then we're going to scrape. I'm only scraping once, not wanting to get them too muddy looking. And then I'm trying to make sure that I get this heart on my fingernail. There we go. So there we go. And I'm going to try to hop in here with some tape and get some of this off right after stamping. And it's not wanting to come off very well, so it's going to be quite the mess. I mean, it's coming off okay but it's not coming off all the way eh. there we go we're gonna head on into the next nail I mean it, it came off okay I'm just I think the colors were you know very pigmented let me look how bright they are so here we go with the next one another heart try to get that one on the nail also ta-da there we go. There you go. You can see it that way. And I'm going to continue on because I'm doing this to all of the nails. As you can see, I'm just moving around this plate. This is one of those plates, and I'm not sure if I'm the only one that calls them this, but I consider these like buffet images to where you could just pick and choose what you want out of it, you know. I mean, you could use the same area of the plate over and over on all the nails and have a match, but, you know, I like plates like this because you can mix and match it. And here we go for the last one, for the pinky nail. I'm doing the same, putting the dots of color down. I just was ready for a fun mani, and this one definitely is fun. Got my girly colors in it and everything. So here we go. Whoops. <laughs> Scrape. Pick up. And transfer. There we go. I've done my cleanup off camera. I'm going to be using this Born Pretty Smudge Free Top Coat. Just kind of seal that stamping in without smearing it. I'm telling you, I'm sold on these smudge-free smudge -free top coats. I'm just digging them. And now I've got my posh, so I'm going to seal the whole manicure in with it. I do wait for the smudge-free to dry before I do this step. Just so you know. <clears throat> there we go. Ta-da! So here is my swatch photo right there. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about it. I want to thank you for watching and until next time, be good to yourself.